Welcome to Wesley's channel. This is Wesley, and it is Wesley's news. Today we have Nelson Rocha with his new Radiant box that has feedback, and it is being presented with both feedback and no feedback. The guy is pretty known to me, and I have a lot of open heart for him he's active blogger as well so Nelson thank you very much for your video you got to my channel and you guys enjoy the show Here is interesting moment when he is only 9 volt battery to power up at least 3 to 600 watts halogen lamp even though that the time is short that battery should not be able to hold it because this battery is being used as the only source to charge the capacitors if there are any there are not many of them and not big. So whatever the charge is, the energy conversion stays by itself. You gotta have to have a juice in order to drink it. And if you don't have one, you don't. That is the moment that I was talking about. And that is why I decided to post that video on my channel. Amazing, isn't it? But I was less knowledgeable. There is no pre-storage, there is no pre-charge. There is no pre-activation of stored energy. So by that, the 9 volt battery shouldn't even light it up take your 100 watts incandescent light bulb and put 9 volt battery on it you're gonna get nothing so now Nelson connects the feedback wire to the device and show it working with self looping at no external power supply at all The device was presented working a very short period of time with self-looping. But again, the question remains open. The battery was connected to the device only for less than one second. So for any energy storage inside the device, it is too short. And we're dealing with halogen lamp, 3 to 600 watts. The concept of the device with no external power supply and no battery that is activated by one impulse from 9 volt battery is known to us from year 2004 the first presentation of Tario Capenaze from Tbilisi, Georgia repeated by Raman Akua from Ooh. Kazakhstan Ruslan from Riga, Latvia SR from Russia and plenty of others about 20 more so repeatedness 
of the same phenomena presented is kind of interesting to me. I witnessed Daryl Kapenaz's device by myself, personally, and I didn't find it to be fakery. You can see more of the details in videos of Nelson Rocha when you go to his channel. As always, I do not have commercial on my channel. I don't make money on it. So please subscribe to my channel, put a like on it, and see you next video. This is Wesley, and it was Wesley's News.